You've entered Dead Zero with Jim. You have to like it or love it. Why not both? It's where we try discussing things and some are pretty decent. Bye. Dead Zero with Jim. Dead Zero with Jim. Dead Zero with Jim. Next thing on dance. What up, party people? It's another episode of Judgment with Germ, and it's a Saturday night, and we are keeping the party rolling. In the we, spot. In the spot. The basement. Shined up leather chairs. Germ got our Dizzle crew. Studios. Yeah, so, Amy's <laughs> sister number one. I'm Amy's sister number two. We got Ben Dog. Koto. 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 Koto, Kyoto, how many okay. How many diapers you know? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Uh, Coco Patty Queen and Mr. Yeah. Germ Dizzle. All right, so we've got caramel cold brew. Caramel. It's caramel. It's caramel. Let's see. Oh, oh Lord. Okay, so mm -hmm. caramel cold brew. M&M's. So, coffee flavor with other natural flavors. No. No. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. So. I got the small bag of those, but I thought they're going to be fantastic. So, yeah. Ooh, so there's big, definitely a coffee taste. Don't you mean smell? I mean, <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I just dug in. I hope these are good. I'm still recovering from the last thing we had. <clears throat> it really got me. The what? The last thing we ate just did not. They're really so. big too. They're like peanut you know, M&M's. They're big. How come they're not shiny? That's all right. Yeah, they didn't go through that. They didn't go through the shine. Yeah, yeah they are kind of dull oh, compared to normal. The matte finish. Maybe they're it's huge a huge compared egg to shell. Maybe it's a. <laughs> maybe they dusted it with coffee. Hmm. I don't know. So. Okay. okay. You ready? Yeah. Mmm, oh. caramel syrup. Why are they chewy? Oh, there's a caramel syrup. Oh, okay. Wow. Oh, that is fantastic. That's fire. These are very coffee forward. Mm-hmm. I'll eat it. Yeah, the, the chewiness really took me by surprise, though. It's, I wasn't it's expecting It's bothering that. the bejesus out of me. Oh, yeah. Mm. That's, it's like a gum. It's supposed to be chewy. It's like gum. Mm-hmm. I'm good. I'm glad they actually put caramel instead of just caramel flavoring in the top. Oh, yeah. Sure. I get it now. <coughs> just was not expecting it. Ten. Bam. That's because I don't eat cold brews and like iced coffee that much. I mean, I have a few sips, but I give it like a seven. But if I was really into coffee, They put their foot in this. Yeah. I mean, it's exactly what it says. I mean, uh, these rank up there with. I mean, these are a damn, damn, damn for me. Almond M and M's. Almond M and M's are supreme, far superior to all the others. These are right up there. Almond are almost the same thing. It's different. I taste the same thing. Peanut is a ghetto almond. That's because you're. Oh dang! Wow. 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 Ghetto almond. Cold brew. Almond is royalty. Peanut is peasant. Mm. That's going a little far. Yeah. yeah when well, you compare it with them, they butter. are. It's like that, but not. I like but peanut butter. butter is amazing, though. Oh, yeah. And almond butter is kind of, yeah. When you're comparing the two, when you take away the almond, the peanut is supreme. My favorite M&M ever created. Okay. Okay. Not good. And then the probably. You haven't thought this out, have you? Right. No. Okay. Really she really just had top one. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. She likes peanut m and Yeah, I love <laughs> peanut m and And then probably the peanut butter and then top of these. Those are good. Favorite. So what, what's your it's opinion of these? And then it has an amazing coffee flavor that hits you from first bite. Yeah. I will say the caramel in the middle 
being a lot more chewy. It gives a weird mouth feel as you chew it. Then, you know, after you chew it for a little bit, the, the caramel comes through and hits you later. But it's a, it's kind of a weird textural thing. Oh, man. They, uh, but the flavor is absolutely there. Mm -hmm. This is a bag at a sitting this. I have to close these up and put them up because yeah, like, that's hey. a little that's a little dangerous. Yeah, I'm glad I got the big bag. I was gonna get a little, but I was like, nah. <laughs> you had a feeling, and I hope these stick around. Yeah. I didn't say limited edition, but I hope these stick around. Amy G, what'd you think? So at first, <clears throat> I was really put off by the chewiness. Like I wasn't really sure what to think, but I am glad they used real caramel because fake caramel taste to me is disgusting. Mm-hmm. So I appreciate the use of the real caramel. And after I got used to it, I mm -hmm. was fine with it and I really liked it. But at first, not knowing that it was real caramel in there. Oh, yeah. I was like, what the heck? What am I doing? What is this? Yeah. And I guess like creating, like they really had to like work to get that chewy caramel in there. Yes. I mean, it was like it took a long time. And, that's that's actually the great coffee flavor. There's a lot of coffee flavor stuff that people don't get coffee. right. Coffee, yeah, coffee. Okay. Coffee. Coffee. coffee, coffee from Boston. Coffee. coffee. This is Jinx. spot on. I mean, this that is coffee. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, that is that is. No, that's really good. That's probably one of the better coffee flavored M and M's that they put out. Yep. Oh yeah, they have so, more. Yeah, they've candy. had a few different yeah. ones, and that one's really good. I like that they use the real caramel mm -hmm. and not the fake Fantastic. stuff. Fantastic. Ten all day. Mm -hmm. Woo! Well done. All right, peeps. If you don't have anything else, one, two, three. We, we out. out.